Bam bam bam. Bada da bam bam ba bam. Hello, hello. Hello, boys. <clears throat> We're up. And I can't think. Yo. Hello, hello. Hello, boys. <clears throat> We're up. And I can't think. Yo. Hello, hello. Hello, boys. <clears throat> We're up. Yo. Yo. So, we're just setting the game up right now. Hello? Hello? Cool. Let's load in some of the game. This is going to be my new series. I'm, I'm just going to try to stream a lot more. Because I enjoy streaming. I have a new game too. I do have a mixer a lot. So, this is a new experience. Hey, it's showing. Let's go, boys. This is my first time playing this game. So we're going to be playing some Doki Doki Literature Club. <laughs> I hope you all enjoy this. It's going to be fun. It's probably going to go for a couple of hours. Hopefully. So we'll be archived on the channel after. And then I'll, I'll probably make a separate. I think I'm going to switch from making content. From um, doing just normal YouTube. By recording videos from streaming. Because I feel like I'll enjoy it. So let's get uh, Excuse me. So let's get into this game. Get this game going. Hey! I see an annoying girl running towards me from a distance, waving her arms up like she's totally oblivious to any attention she can be drawing herself. The girl is silently. My neighbor, good friend since we were children. You know, the kind of friend you never see yourself making today. But it just kind of works out because you know each other for so long. We used to walk to school together on days like this, but starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently, and I would just get tired of waiting up. But if she's going to chase me after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. However, I just sigh and idle in front of the crosswalk and let Sayori catch up with me. Ah! I overslept again. I you I you I over I overslept again. I over I overslept again. But I caught you this time. Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. You say that like you were thinking about me, were you? That's me, Joshy boy. I love this name already. People stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. 
Okay. Fine, fine. But you did wait for me after all. I guess you don't have... I, I guess you don't have it in you to be mean to me even if you want to. Tilda. Whatever you... Whatever you say, Sayori. I'm gonna do whatever you say, Sayori. <laughs> we walk across the street together and make our way to school. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their day daily commute. By the way, Joshua Boy, have you decided to join any club yet? My club? I, I told you already, I'm not interested in joining any clubs. I haven't been looking either. <coughs> hey, that's not true. You told me you'd join a club this year. Did I? I'm sure. Possible that I did in one of our many conversations where I dismissively go along with whatever I say she's going on about. Whatever she's going on about. Sayori looks likes to worry a little too much about me when I'm perfectly content just getting my eye on the average while spending free time on the games of anime. Uh huh. I was talking about I'm worried that you won't learn how to socialize and have any social skills before time. Your happiness is really important to me, you know? <coughs> I know you're happy now. I know you're happy now, but I died the thought that you become me in a few years because you're not used in the real world. It's not really cool. You trust me? Don't make me keep worrying about you. Alright, alright. I'll look, I'll look at a few clubs if it makes you happy. No problem. No, <laughs> no promises, though. Will you at least? Will you at least promise me? Promise me you'll try a little. Yeah, yeah, I promise. I guess I'll promise you that. Yay, Tilda. <laughs> why do? Why do I let myself get lectured by such a character? Girl? More than that, I'm surprised you even let her. I let myself relent to her. I guess seeing her worry so much makes me want to ease her mind just a little bit. Even if she just a little bit. 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 <laughs> even, if, even if it does exaggerate everything inside her head. I mean, the school day is ordinary as ever. And it's before I know it. And it's over before I know it. After I packed up my things, I stared blankly at the wall looking for an ounce of motivation. Sayori walks up to me and out of the clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start a meet with the anime club. Hello? Sayori. Sayori must have came into the classroom while I was facing out. I look around and realize that I'm the only one left in the classroom. I'm the only one left in the classroom. I thought I'd catch up with coming out of something, but I saw you just sitting there and spacing out. So I came in. Oh, that's Sayori. Okay, my bad. I thought I'd catch you coming out of the classroom, but I saw you just sitting here and spacing out, so I came in. Honestly, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. You don't need to wait up for me if it's gonna make you late to your own club. Okay, sorry. Forgive me. Well, I thought I might, you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know... You know what? Well, that you could come to my club! Say, are you? Yeah. There's no way I'm going to your club. <laughs> so I was the vice president of the literature club. And it's not that not that I was ever aware that she had any interest in literature. In fact, I'm 90% 99% sure that she would be joining because it would be fun to help start a new club. I know it's so sorry. And I'm not gonna put them on because I feel like it. <sighs> Since she was the first one to show interest after it. Since she was the first one to show any interest after the uh, after the one who proposed the club, she inherited the title of vice president. She's the principal now. That said, my interest in literature is guaranteed to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Come on, please. Why do you care so much, anyway? Well, I kind of told my club mates yesterday I would bring you, bring a new member. And that's if you made cupcakes and everything. 
<laughs> Don't make any promises you can keep. I tell so I can't tell if Sayori was really that much of an airhead, or if she's so cunning to have planned all of this out. I left. Fine, I'll stop by for a cupcake, okay? Let's, yes, let's go! Dildo. And thus today marks the day I sold my soul, f soul for a cupcake. I dejectedly follow Sayori across the school and upstairs at a section of the school I rarely visit, being generally used for the third year classes and activities. Sayori, full of energy, swings open the classroom door. Everyone, this new... The new member is here. Dilda. I told you, don't call me a new member. Uh, uh, eh, I glance around the room. No. This one. Increasingly colder in here. Okay. Should I do some ASMR? No, 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 no. Seriously? You brought a boy? No, no, that's not the voice! No. No, I refuse. Um, um, um. Serious, seriously, you brought a, brought a boy? Seriously, you brought a boy? Way to kill the atmosphere! Ah. Uh. I'm gonna do like a sadistic kind of sassy thing. Ah, Josh boy, what a nice surprise. Yeah, I like this voice. Welcome to the club. This isn't what I was explaining it was gonna be, but this is what it's gonna be. Meh. All words escape me in this situation. This club is full of people. <coughs> oh. Also is one who made cupcakes according to Sayori. You can you can just ignore her with her when she gets moody. Sayori says quietly in my oh. You can just ignore her when she gets moody. Sayori says quietly in my ear, then turns back towards the other girls. Anyway, anyway, this is Natsuki. Full always full of energy. And this is Yuri, the smartest in the club. Yuri, who appears uh, comparable, more mature and timid, seems to have a hard time keeping up with people like Sayori and Natsuki. Ah, well, it's nice to meet both of you. And it sounds like you already know Monica, is that right? That's right. That's right. No, that's right. That's right. It's great to see you again, don't you? Monica smiles sweetly. We do know each other. We rarely talk, but we were both in the same class last year. Monica was probably the most popular girl, smart, beautiful, and athletic. Basically, completely out of my league. So having her smile at me so genuinely makes me feel a little bit. Y you, you too, Monica. Come sit down, Joshy boy. We. <laughs> I can't get over my name. Come sit down, Joshy boy. We made room for you at the table so you can sit next to me or Monica. I'll get cupcakes. I made them. I'll get them. Why am I doing a monkey voice? Okay. So 
Sorry, I got a little too excited. Matilda. How about I? How about I make some tea as well? The girls have a few desks arranged for the table. As Sarah mentioned, it's between. It's a bin widened, so there's one space next to Monica and one space next to Sarah. Natsuki and Yuri walk over to the corner of the room. Natsuki grabs a wrap tray and Yuri opens the closet. Still awkward, still feeling awkward, I sit next to Sayuri. Natsuki proudly marches back to the table, tray in hand. Oh, okay, okay, <gasps> are you ready? No. Ta da! Ooh, ooh! Natsuki lifts the foil off the tray and reveals a, to a dozen white fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like. The whiskers are drawn with icing and little pieces of chocolate were used to make ears. So cute! Tilda. I had no idea. I had no idea you were so good at making baking, Natsuki. <laughs> well, you know. Just hurry and take one. Siri grabs one first, then Monica. I follow. It's delicious. It's delicious. Siri takes a talks to them with her mouth. It's nice. And Siri talks with her mouthful as she already managed to get icing on her face. I turn the cupcake around in my fingers looking for the best angle to bite it. That's gonna be quiet. I can't help but notice she's sneaking glances in my, in my direction. As she is wait is she waiting for me to take a bite? I finally bite down. The icing is sweet and full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. This is Ah! Thank you, Tom. Oh, no. Thank you. Thank you, Natsuki. Well, what, why are you thanking me? It's not like I... Haven't you heard... Haven't I heard this somewhere before? We made them for you or anything. <laughs> I thought you technically did. So they already set... Well, maybe! No. Not for you. You, you know. You, you don't eat. give up on Natsuki's weird logic and dismiss this conversation. Yuri returns to the table carrying a set of tea. She carefully places the teacup in front of each of, uh, each of us before setting down the tea box. You keep a oh, you keep a whole tea set in the classroom? Don't worry, the teachers gave us permission. After all, does a cup of hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? Uh, Don't, don't let Yuri intim- Don't let Yuri- Don't let yourself get intimidated. Yuri's just trying to impress you. <laughs> that's- that's not true. Insulting, Yuri looks away. I meant that, you know. I, I believe you. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but at least I enjoy tea. Applaud. Yuri faint- Yuri fl faintly smiles to herself. Monica raises her eyebrow and smiles at me. So, what made you consider the liter- So, what made you consider the literature club? I see. Um, I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monica that I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Well, I haven't joined any clubs yet, and Sayori really seemed to enjoy it here, so... That's okay, don't seem embarrassed. We'll make sure you feel right at home, okay? As president of the Literature Club, it's my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. Monica, I'm surprised. How come you decided to start your own club? You could probably be the board of any club, any member of the major clubs. Weren't you the leader of the debate club last year? A leader? Ahaha! <laughs> well, you know. To be honest, I can't stand all the politics, politics, <laughs> I would say, I'm gonna say politics for now the politics around the major clubs. It feels like nothing but arguing around the budget and pu publicity and how to prepare for events. I'd much rather take something personally than I personally enjoy and make something special on it. And if it encourages others to get into literature, then I'm fulfilling a good dream. Monica really is a good leader. They're holding to Then I'm surprised there aren't 
more members in this club yet. It must be really hard to start a new club. You could, you could put it that way. Not many people are very interested in putting out all the effort to start something brand new. Especially when it's something that doesn't grab your attention, like literature. You have to work hard to convince people that you're both fun and worthwhile. It, but it makes the school events like a festival that are much more important. I'm confident that we can all really grow from this club before we graduate. Grow this club. Right, everyone? Yeah! We'll do our best. You know it! Everyone enthusiastically agrees. Such different girls, all interested in the same goal. My film is really hard to just find these three. Maybe that's why they're, they were here all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. No, I still don't really know if I can keep up with their, le their level of enthusiasm about literature. So, Joshy Boy, what kind of things do you like to read? Oh, uh, well, well, uh... Considering how little I've read in the past few years, facts, I don't... <laughs> I really don't have a good uh, way of answering. Ma manga? suddenly breaks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not, not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. What are you saying? I spoke without thinking after seeing Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, that... Well, then, let's see. She traces the rim. She traces the rim of her teacup with her finger. My favorites are usually novels that build up in complex fantasy worlds. The level of create oh the level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. And telling a good story in such a poor world is equally impressive. Yuri goes on, clearly passionate about her reading. She seems so reserved and timid since the moment I walked in, but obviously by the way her eyes light up that she finds uh light up that she finds her comfort in the world of books that I read a horror book once. I desperately grasp something I can relate at, to a minimum level. At this rate, Yuri might as well have been already conversation. Yuri might have been having conversations with Rock. I'm sorry, guys. I'm really sorry. I'm not good at this. Really? I wouldn't have expected that, Yuri. For someone so gentle as you. I guess you could say that. <laughs> your cupcakes, eh? <laughs> your cupcakes, your poems, everything you do is just cute as you are. Sari sidles. Sari sidles up behind Natsuki and puts her hands on her shoulders. I'm not cute! Um, chat, is the audio okay? Because I feel like me screeching might hurt. I don't know. Hopefully it's not bad. Okay. Natsuki, you write your own poems. I guess sometimes. Why do you care? I think that's impressive. Why don't you share some sometimes? Share them sometimes. No! Next, not to hear her eyes. If you wouldn't like that. Ah, not a confident writer yet. Says the one who hates literature and was forced to join the club. Okay. I understand how that's keeping. Do 
you have any, do you have writing experience too, Yuri? Maybe if, maybe if you share some of your work, you can, you can set up an example to help Natsuki feel comfortable enough to share her. <coughs> I guess like, it's the same for you. Oh, I don't want to read everyone's poems. We'll sit in silence for a moment. Okay. I have an idea, everyone. Tell them. <clears throat> Bleh. Bleh? That's a key and read. Look quiz at quizzically Looks look quizzically at mama. I'm getting bleed. I'll go home and write a poem of our own. Then, next time we meet, we all share that, them to it with each other. That way, everyone is even. Um. That. Yeah, let's do it. Plus, now that we can have a, num a new member. <laughs> Plus, now that we have a new member, I think we can all help us get a little more comfortable with each other and strengthen our bond of the club. Isn't that right, Joshy boy? Monica smiles one way and the one's more again. Hold up! There is still one problem. Eh? What's that? Now that we're back into the original time to go join in the club, I want to come forth with what's been on my mind the entire time. I never said I would join in this club, but you've been here this entire time. Eating their cupcakes and just talking to them, right? And being like, you should write more and all this stuff. And then being like, I, I'm enjoying your starting to pop, Joshua Boy. He's a jerk. I don't like him. <laughs> I hate him already. Sarah may have convinced me to stop by, but I never made any decision. I still have other clubs to look at, and um, I lose my train of thought. All four girls stare back at me with jacked eyes. But, but. I'm sorry, I thought. Hmm. Hush, you boy. It's not like that was important or anything, but yeah, as I said, Sayori's voice is probably the best, then Monica's, then Yuri's, and then Natsuki's. The voices. You, 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 you all, I'm, uh, I, I'm, I'm, Defenseless against these girls. How am I supposed to make a clear-headed decision when it's like this? That is, that is, if I'm writing poems at the price I need to pay to spend this every day with these beautiful girls. But right. Okay, then I've decided then I'll join the literature club. It's not like you all make me. One by one, the girls in this life. But yes, I'm so happy. Sarah wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey. I would be super angry. Then that makes then that makes it official. Welcome to the literature club. Ah, thanks, I guess. Okay, everyone. I think with that we can officially end today's meeting with on a good note. Ever remember tonight's assignment? Write a poem to bring to bring to the meeting so we can call we can all so we can all share. I am so good. I'm so good at reading. I'm like the best. Yup. Monica looks over at me once more. Joshy boy, I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. <laughs> Tell them. Y yeah. They're, they're, those voices are merging together. Like, badly. Like, I'm struggling. I'm sorry. I can really... Can I really impress the class star Monica with my mediocre writing skills? I already feel anxiety welling up inside me. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit-chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. Hey, Joshy boy, since we're already here, do you want to walk home together? That's right. Sayori and I never walk home together anymore because she always starts staying after school for clubs. Sure, I might as well. I hate you. Yay! Tell them. 
with that, with that, the two of us depart the club room and make our way home. The whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between the four girls. Sayori, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course, Monica. Will I really be happy? I really be happy spending every day after school in the literature club. Perhaps I have a chance to go closer to one of these girls. See, I know how this game goes and how it ends. I know the ins and outs of this game. And I'm, like, I like it. And the story is fun. But I can't wait until we get to, like, way later on. That's when it gets really fun. I've never played it before. But I'm hoping that I can stream this. I'm gonna try to stream daily. But yeah. This, this sounds like an ending stream now. All right, I just want to say I just need to make one, the most of my circumstances. I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess it starts with writing a poem today. Words, I think a favorite club member would like something good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we have to write a poem, so I don't know who we're gonna pick. <laughs> nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but at least I keep it with. Well, I'm back at the literature club, and I was the last to come in, so everyone else is already in here. It's super bad. Thought I was going first. <laughs> Thanks so much for keeping your promise, Joshy boy. I hope this isn't too overwhelming. Guys, Joshy Boy always gives us the best as long as he's having fun. He helps me do busy work without me even asking. Like cooking, cleaning my room because you're lazy and I have to do it for you. 
incompetent swine. I hate you. That's because your room is messy and it's distracting. Almost set your house on fire once. Is that so? <laughs> Don't you see? You two are really good friends, aren't you? It might be. I might be a little jealous. How come you and Joshy Boy can be? How come you and Joshy Boy can become good friends too? Uh, uh, uh. Sayori. Hmm. It, as usual, Sari seems oblivious to the weird situation she just put. Oh, oh, Yuri, you even brought something that didn't you? Tell them. What? what, what? Oh, wait, Sari. And me? Oh, no, no, not really. Don't be shy, Tilda. It's really nothing. I like imagining Yuri. What is it? But never mind. Sorry. Sorry, made it sound like it's a big deal, but it's it's really not that. Uh, uh, what, what, what do I do? Uh, I'm sorry, Yuri. I was thinking. I guess that means it's up to me to rescue the situation. Oh, boy! No, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry for the truth. Hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So, any nice gesture from you is a pleasant surprise. It don't make me happy no matter what. Is that so? so the voice is starting to pick up. Yeah, I won't make it a big deal if you don't want it to be. Alright. Well, here. Here reaches into her bag and pulls out a book. I didn't want you to... I didn't want you to feel left out. something in there? Freaking Monica! She never puts my stuff back in the right spot. What's the point of keeping your collection organized if someone else is gonna mess it up? Natsuki slides a bunch of stack paper, uh, stack books and boxes across the shelf. Manga? You, you read manga? You read manga, right? Uh, uh, sometimes. Manga is one of those things you were, you can't admit you really into until you figure out the other person's say. You said it to Yuri yesterday. Out loud. You're like, yeah, I only do. So why are you lying to her? She has, and it's like, she's trying to figure out the other stand. She has a collection in the closet. What is wrong with you? I hate you, Josh. You're stupid, ugly. 
maybe you should just go hang around. How did you know anyway? I heard you bring it up at some point yesterday. Besides, it's kind of raining all over your face. What's that supposed to be? I, I see. There's one alone volume manga amidst the stack of various books on one side of the shelves. Curiously, I pull it out of the stack. But there it is! Natsuki snatches it out of my hand. When she turns to the box of manga and slips the volume right into the middle of the rest. Ah, much better! Seeing a box, seeing a box set with one book missing is probably the most irritating sight in the world. Besides having something stuck in your eye, like pepper spray. That's not an irritating sight. I guess it's not, it's pain. What's this? It's China. <coughs> I just noticed that. That was weird. Okay. I get distracted, so I'm sorry. I know, I know that feeling. I get closer and look in the boxes as she seems set she's in my room. Parfait! A series I've never heard of in my life. That probably means it's either way out of my demographic or it's simply terrible because I'm the best model collector in the world. If you're, if you're gonna judge, you can go do it some through that glass from the door. She points at the glass. She points at the classroom door. Hey! Hey, I wasn't judging anything. I'm so sorry. I'm getting mixed up in all these voices. Ay, ay, ay. Uh, if you're just tuning in, I picked Natsuki for the poem, so I wrote that written about her. Because Sarah and Sarah. Yuri is not as long as Sarah, but she's like, and we all love it. Haha. <laughs> I'm killing it myself. Ha! 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 I have a problem. Okay. That didn't even, you didn't, I didn't even say anything. It, it was the tone of your voice. But I'll tell you one thing, Joshy boy. Consider this a lesson straight from the literature. Don't judge a book by its cover. I hate you already. In fact, Natsuki pulls out a first volume of Park Table with the girls from the box. I'm going to show you exactly why. She shoves the book right in my hand. Ah. I stare at the corner. The full picture, the features four girls in colorful, striking, animated, uh, animated feminine poses. Hmm, that sounds familiar. It's exceedingly low. I don't know what that means. Moe? I heard someone before I watched this movie, so it's not like that. Don't just stand there! Oh, uh, what? Na Natsuki grabs her and pulls me out of the closet. So I was at, when did I get in there? Okay. She then takes a seat against the wall beneath the window, so she pats the ground next to her, signaling for me to sit there. Wouldn't the chairs just be more comfortable? Okay. I take my seat. Chairs won't work. We can't read at the same time. Uh, why not? Why is that? I, uh, I guess it, this is easier. We'd be closer like this. Me! <laughs> Don't just say that. You'll make me feel weird about it. That's it. He crosses her arms and scooches an inch away from me. Sorry. 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 I didn't exactly, I didn't exactly expect sitting this closer either. Not that this says the particularly bad thing. Oh, so only a few seconds before Natsuki. Once I had inches closer, claiming the additional space while she hopes I am in place. I can feel her peering over my shoulder, much more eager to begin reading than I am. <coughs> wow! How long has it been since you the beginning? Hmm? You don't go back and flip through the older volumes every now and then, you iridescent flint beetle? Come on. Sometimes after I have already finished the series. Hey, are you even paying attention? Um, I am, but nothing's really happening yet, so I talk at the same time. Duh, stupid idiot. <laughs> it looks, it looks like, it, it looks like, um, I have a bad habit right now, I'm sorry. It looks like some, it's about, 
It looks like it's about to. F uh, it looks like it's about a bunch of friends in high school. Ha! One, two, three, four, all in feminine poses at the beginning in high school. What does this remind you? A typical slice of life affair. Ha ha! It kind of grew out of me since it's rare for the way to be entertaining enough for me. So, what should I expect from this? Is there going to be a plot? Well, obviously. I think I would enjoy something that didn't have a plot. I mean, well, I guess I know what you're saying. A lot of beginning is simple. A lot of, a lot of beginning is simple for me. Like, there's a really funny chapter where they're obsessed with a guy at the ice cream shop. Hum. Hum. Hum and hum and hum and But that's just... I'm so sorry. My, my eyes are out But that just helps you get to know the characters. And besides, it's still entertaining. But later on, there's all kinds of drama. Like when they got all into the backstories, and when some of the romance stuff starts to happen, it really lo makes it look so good. And so many touchy part touching parts. Ah, is that so? I'm gonna make my guy sound super sarcastic. Not mine, I'm gonna make Joshy boy sound super sarcastic. It sounds like you're, it sounds like you're really, no it sounds like in his head, but not like when he talks out loud, he's gonna be like, like Okay. <laughs> It sounds like you really know what you're talking about. Maybe I underestimated you. <laughs> hey, wait! What's that supposed to mean? Uh, uh, what? Uh, what? Natsuki gives me a little shove. I just met. I haven't met someone. Haven't seen. Haven't yet seen you after at your full power. Shaggy, nine thousand percent power. Hmm. Good save. Ah, this chapter seems like it's about baking. This is just a guess, but there's a lot of baking in this manga. Well! Natsuki pauses for a moment. She doesn't want to admit something. Yeah. Why does that matter? It doesn't... It doesn't... I was just curious. Uh, it doesn't. I was just curious. Since you enjoy baking too, right? That's... Just a coincidence! I think not. I just happened to get into big air at the same time I got into this manga. Like I would ever admit, get into thick anything because it's in a manga. I feel bad for anything that impressionable. For anything that impressionable. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh. Uh -huh. Definitely not a coincidence. <laughs> I guess that explains Natsuki's interest in baking. Still, all of her hobbies pick all of the hobbies to pick up for a manga that's definitely one of the better ones. Not to mention she's really good at it, so I'm not to- who am I to judge? This would have been a way better thing to have the whole time since we're sitting down! Now I'm not gonna make a noise for that because there's no time. We read it for a few um, for a few minutes. I should have a couple of chapters at this point. Uh Are you are you sure this isn't boring for you? It's not! Even though you're just watching me read. Well, if you say so. I guess that's the fun of sharing something you like uh, with anyone else. I always get excited when I convince any of my friends to pick up a series I enjoy. You know what I mean? The, eh? Hmm. Hmm. You don't? Oh. Uh, oh. That's not. Well, you don't. You don't really know. You wouldn't really know. What do you mean? You don't share. Friends. Don't her from it in. She needs. Ah, uh -huh, sorry. Hmm. I can never get my friends to read this. They're just thinking about this for kids. I can't even bring it up without them being like, hey, you still haven't grown out of this yet? This makes, makes me want to punch them in the face. Er, kind of uh, I know those kind of people. Honestly, it takes a lot of effort for, to find friends who don't judge, much less friends that are also into it. I'm already kind of a loser, so I guess gravitating towards the other losers over time. <laughs> She's calling Sayori a loser. I'm just saying, I don't know. But it's probably it's harder for someone like you. Yeah, that's pretty accurate. 
Wait, which part? I mean, I feel I feel like I can't even keep up with my my room. I didn't even know what my dad would do with this. At least it's safe here in the corner. in words the feeling that when you get when connecting with someone else it's something you like or being able to provide that to Natsuki for who it's a real experience a thought makes me smile a thought makes me smile to myself okay everyone why is our game okay everyone hey are you all ready for today's promise Sorry. Tilda. So you're in the background, just in the corner, just going to be like, Tilda. <laughs> I just need to make sure everyone's, we have enough time. Though, you do look pretty cozy over there. <laughs> He suddenly notices how close she's gotten to me. She hastily slides herself a good 12 inches away from me. All right. All right. Guess I'll stop here, then. I close the book and hands it towards Natsuki. You're just giving it back? Don't you want to, like, you know, know what happens? Uh, yeah, but... Monica just... Monica just said... Don't be dumb! Just take it home with you! Eh? <laughs> like the eh? Is that really all right? Is that really all right? I say it mostly because I didn't uh, plan to use it in my spare time to read this. Well, of course. It would take forever to finish it. It would take it home. We'll just finish it one before tomorrow so we can start the next year at one. Right? right. If it gets bad, I'll kill you. By tomorrow? I only got partway through this volume so far. I might fall behind with some show. Come on. it's just, it, I've seen. I don't read manga or anything, but I've seen them. They're tiny. You can... It'll probably take like half an hour, maybe maybe 45 minutes to finish it. Like, come on, dude, just chill to get through this. But I suppose it's, necess it's a necessary sac sacrifice to exchange for seeing Natsuki's enthusiastic face. Or am I just scared to see what happens if I don't finish it? All right, then. I stand up. I return to where I put my stuff and carefully split the book into my bag. By the way, did you remember to write a poem last night? It, yeah. My relaxation ends. I can't believe I agreed to do something so embarrassing. I couldn't really find much inspiration since I've never really done this before. Well, now that everyone's ready, why don't you find yourself someone to share with? I can't wait. Tilda. Sayori and Monica enthusiastically pull out their poems. Sayori's is wrinkled sheet and loose leaf paper from the smile of the book. On the other hand, Monica will her in a composition of the book. I can already see Monica's pristine handwriting where I can where I sit. Natsuki and Yuri uh, reluctantly comply as well. Rachel, why does it look like she faxed it? Like someone else wrote it or her mom Okay. Ba, ba, ba. 
I do the same. It's so Okay. Who do you, I show my poem to first. Okay, so this is what I'm going to ask you boys in chat, or females, I don't know, to tell me who should I pick to share my poem first. interesting in her poems yesterday. It's probably only fair if I shared mine with hers first. Eh. 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 Okay. Okay, well, let's start with things first I don't like. First of all, um, eh. Natsuki, Natsuki rereads my poem. N never mind. I don't feel like giving you my opinion. Eh? What? <laughs> then what's the point of sharing the poem in the first place? I wrote this when I could have been doing other things. In fact, I remember how I said I wanted to read your poems. That's what I had in mind when writing this. I want to help you feel comfortable sharing even enough to share yours, like Monica said. Uh, well, I would be more comfortable sharing my poems if yours was really bad. If you're supposed to show me something dumb and make me go, huh, well, that's, it's not that great, but let me show you what real literature looks like. And when, and you can ruin that. Eh? So, in other words, you're saying you liked it. <laughs> Natsuki's retort gets caught. Uh, retort gets caught in her throat. Uh, you're so. You're just. You don't understand anything, do you? I already told you. You don't have to go announcing it to all the world like that. You're all self-important. Pretty sure. Pretty sure you never actually said that. <laughs> I say mostly to. I say that mostly to myself. Natsuki really must hate me right now. I can't figure out if it's a win or loss that she like really likes me. In any case, you still need to show me yours, right? Uh, fine, I guess. I guess only because Monica will make me do it if I don't. Eagles can fly. Monkeys? Huh? Eagles can fly. Monkeys can climb. Crickets can leap. Horses can race. Owls can seek. Cheetahs can run. Eagles can fly. People can try, but that's about it. Jeez, Natsuki, your voice got really deep. Yeah. I told you you can't. You weren't going to like it. Well, I like it. What? Just be honest. I, I am. Don't question. Don't double cross me, Natsuki. Or I will cut you. No, Why are you so convinced I wouldn't like it? Well. Because everyone in high school thinks your that writing has to be all sophisticated and stuff, so people don't even take the poem seriously. But, I, but is the poem? Is, but isn't the point of a poem to for people to express themselves? Your writing style wouldn't make your message any less valid. Yes, exactly. I like it when people, it's easy to read, but it's too hard. Like in this poem. Because that is a extremely good poem. I'm crying. Tears, how good that was. It was so good that I can't get over it. So I want you to know that, Natsuki. You're the best. Okay. Let's do this. Seeing everyone around you doing great things can really be disheartening. So I decided to write a poem out. Yeah. Yeah, I understand. But the other nice thing. That simply reading is about to put more weight on the wordplay. 
because I know what I'm saying. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I have a problem. Okay. Like I set up for a rhyme and then, but then made it fall flat on purpose. It helps bring people out of failing in the last line. So, so you did. I guess you uh, uh, went into this thing at least. That's what it means to be a pro. Pro at being bad. Oh, got him. I'm glad you learned something. Didn't expect that from the youngest one here, did you? Yeah, I guess not. I decided to humor her with the last con. I don't really care how old everyone is, but Natsuki is feeling loud and, pr uh, loud and proud when I don't, won't take that away from her. Okay. And then he'll go to prison for child danger. Turns out my guy's 56 years old and the teacher. <coughs> okay. So, we're gonna go with no one, because I'm gonna end the stream here. Bum, 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 bum. I hope you all enjoyed. Um, I'll see you guys next time. Uh, please like and subscribe if you ever need. You're gonna hit the family and friends and And I'll see y'all next time. Yeah, empty slot. Okay. Bye. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say bye to chat. But oh, looks like no one chat anything. So I can't say bye to chat. Because that's not how it works.